so yeah i hope you guys liked the video um 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 okay i'm in frame Hey guys, so today we are going to be making a video about my hair and how I um, style it and curl it and everything, like the process, but I just want to like tell you a little bit about my hair. I cut it like a few months ago, like up to right here, I think, like underneath my collarbone by myself at like 2 a.m. I was like going through something and I was like, oh, heck no. And so I just like cut it all the way off with like some really dull scissors. It was like a really bad thing and a bad idea. But the next day I like ran to my sister's house and like I made her fix it just like all the way straight. And I have had that for like maybe like a month. And finally I decided like, I got bored with my hair again. So I decided to like fully like cut it like past my shoulders I guess like a little bit past my shoulders and it was kind of like a lob cut there's like a bunch of like um inspiration on Pinterest and I think I just got it from there but um yeah um it was kind of like a little shorter in the back and then like a little bit like longer in the front and I didn't ask for layers because if you get layers with super short hair it like goes like it has like, it goes like different directions, I guess. So like it would go to the right and the left. So I decided, or I told the lady to just like cut it straight, maybe like a little bit of layer, but not really. Um, it just depends also on the texture of your hair. I have like super fine Asian, really, really straight hair. And so it's like super hard to just kind of like play with just cause like it just goes flat. But um, yeah, so we're gonna start with washing my hair. Okay guys, so a little bit of disclaimer. I like have no idea how to film a video with a camera. I'm literally using a camera, so I feel so legit. This is it. Look at that. And I don't even have like a flip screen. Like I have the Sony A Alpha 6000 and it doesn't flip. So it's not really meant for vlogging or whatever, but I'm using it because it's all I have. It's either this or my iPhone and I'd rather use this for now. So I feel legit, honestly, but yeah, this is how my hair turned out, if you didn't see it enough during the video. I think I've showed it enough, so I hope you guys enjoy the video. There you go. <laughs> After you shower, you basically just dry your hair. Um, I used this, like, on-air um, hair blow dryer, and I used um, this, like, hair conditioner that someone gave me for my church. But um, I basically already blow dried it. I don't want to show you guys just because, like, I don't know, but it is still kind of wet, so I'm going to continue to, like, blow dry it and show you guys for the video, I guess. Okay, and, um, usually I don't really blow dry my hair just because, like, I don't know, I'm not usually in a rush, and if I am in a rush, I don't really curl my hair. And um, I don't use any, like, um, what's it called? The brown brushes to blow dry my hair. I just, like, dry in, like, different directions. Um, and it is still kind of wet, like, under here. It's still, like, a little bit damp. But I don't usually also, like, curl my hair down there just because you can't really see it. And with, like, short hair, like, you do so little with it and it still looks good. So, um, what else? Um... Yeah, so after like I dry my hair with a blow dryer, I usually like to wait um, and do some stuff in between before I curl my hair because I like it kind of like n like with no moisture anymore because if your hair has moisture, then it like doesn't hold the curls that much longer than when it is like super dry. And so yeah, I wait usually after I dry my hair, I would like, I'm probably going to do some stuff on the laptop and make some food and we'll see we will be right back so this is how my hair usually feels like and looks like um right after i shower and after i blow dry it it's still kind of like wet and when you like touch your hair it's still like super soft and a little bit moist so you just like do some stuff and like wait until your hair gets like a little bit of texture i guess and yeah, just wait it out and we're gonna go downstairs. 
Okay, so it has been quite some time since we last talked. It's been like a couple hours, maybe two hours. Um, I picked up my mom and did some stuff. And so now we're just gonna go start curling our hair. Um, earlier it was like split in the middle, but now it's kind of like towards the right side. Um, what I usually do is that I just kind of like do this. Just run it like that and do that. Does that make sense? And then right here, we do the same thing. And then, so I don't really leave it for a very long time because I don't like super like defined curls, if you know what I mean. And then I take a little piece of hair like that again. And then curl it the other way and then do that so I just kind of like do it on the top of my head I like focus more on the hairs like on top not really on the bottom I mean we will end up doing that later but like just to try to like fix things you know what I mean so you just do this like that and then you start curling pieces that are underneath that you can like see, but not really. You just like that little bend, like the bend, like a little bit. So recently I like burned my leg, like with my curling iron, like pretty bad. It was like a second degree burn. Um, it was not fun, you guys. It still hurts right now, and it happened like maybe a week and a half ago, almost two weeks ago. But so, do you see that? I mean, it's still kind of like a little bit def more defined than I like, but throughout the day, it just kind of like goes down. So it's like that, and then we go on the other side. The front parts, I don't really curl it as much. I just like run it like that. And this is like, I think like a one inch barrel. I'm not sure. You see the lights like that. And so that's basically all that I do. Can you see it? I don't know, can you? <laughs> So yeah, that is what I do with my hair. Um, I usually, I would use like maybe like a texturizing spray like this one. I use like the Way Wave Spray, I guess. It's like the travel size one. So that that's what it looks like on the side. It's not like super curled. Just play around with it. So that's my hair. <laughs> it gets, it's like really big right now, but I don't know, I like it. Okay, I really hope this is working right now because I have, I am sweating, okay? And this turtleneck is not helping me at all. This is basically like the end result um, it's different every time, so you don't really get what you want every time. There's some days where it's like super curly, and there's some days where it's just like your hair is totally flat. And I'm actually really surprised that my hair turned out like somewhat okay. I like actually really like it, but I'm not even doing anything. I just filmed the video for you guys. I don't even know who I'm talking to. I'm literally just doing this. We'll see. <laughs> okay, so yeah, so that's basically how I do my hair. Um, it's different every time, like what I said earlier. Um, if you feel like cutting your hair, I think you should just go for it. I think short hair looks good on every single person who can rock and have the confidence to. Um, I've always had like super long hair, I guess, and that's kind of just like my comfort blanket to like distract people away from my face and my body and it's not a good thing um, and one day I just decided to like chop it all the way and it was good at first I hated my short hair I was like oh my god 
gosh. But um, you grow to love it, actually. Um, I cut my hair um, super long ago, actually, like a few months ago. And now I'm just starting to like it because um, I like figured out how to like style it. You know, you just have to like play with it. So yeah, if you guys like the video, um, comment down below. I don't know. I don't know how this works.